Hey crafters, this is Nye here. So today what we are going to be doing, we're going to be assembling some Halloween door corner decor. So as you can see, I've got two of these here for you. And we're gonna start with this first one that is kind of like just says Happy Halloween and it's got the spider web. I'm gonna be using my art glitter glue here for all of my gluing. And as you can see, I've got my pieces cut out and I have them kind of stacked on top of one another. Now with this file, what you could do is you could choose to use craft board just to cut these. Um, you could also up your cardstock weight to like the 110 um, just to kind of give it some more support. I've cut this part here with craft board and this one's just regular 65 pound cardstock. But basically what you're gonna do is you're just gonna go ahead and start to add some glue. Now I'm gonna work here with my letters first. I probably, yeah. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just kind of going along and I'm adding the glue here to the back of the wording because I'm just gonna lay these right on top of each other. And this is really just gonna be kind of like um, a fun just layering project. And so I'm picking up this one here and I'm gonna hold it between my fingers to kind of help me get it into the right position here. And so you can see that it's, there it goes. And I'm going to kind of have the same thing happen down here. Now I'm gonna start with the spider web first. You can kind of see that the spider seems a little bit off. Um, I might just end up kind of shifting that one on its own. So I'm going to start here with this part. I'm actually just gonna add the glue to the back here. And so you can just see and coming out and just adding it to all of the spider web. This is gonna be um, one of those projects that you really wanna make sure that your glue has that needle point to just kind of help you to get everything in the right spot here. And so this, I feel like I'm kind of just drawing it <laughs> with the glue here. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna put this one down now and really just take your time to make sure that you're getting it lined up right on top of each other. And so you can see still that my spider is a little off here. So again, let me see if I can turn my angle a little so the camera picks it up better. And then I'm just gonna add a little bit here to the legs of my spider that's hanging down. All right, and then just placing it right on top. And there we go, that's super cute. All right, there we go. I got glue on my table, but that's not Neil. <laughs> okay, and so we've got this part of um, the O in the Halloween here that's gonna represent our pumpkin. And so I cut these two pieces in different colors just to kind of add something to the design. And so I'm placing it right on top there. Same thing, let me make sure I've got my orientation correct, yep. And just adding the glue to the back here and then placing it down. You could be using your tweezers if you want I tend to work a little bit more with my fingers only because it's easier for me to, to feel where the paper is ending at. And so that's this one. So it's just kind of fun and cool and different. Let's put the second one together. This one's just our spooky ghost friends. And so for this one, I caught this one again, um, just in cardstock. But if you wanted to, for the extra support, you could cut this back layer using black um, craft craft board only because that extra support will help um, for sturdiness. Or again, you could just up your cardstock weight to like 110 cardstock. All right, so I did that part first. I'm just adding a little bit of glue and then I'm using my fingers here to help me line these up. And it's really important that you get everything lined up because otherwise then everything starts to get a little off and it could get a little tricky. 
So I'm just adding the glue here to this part. Let me move up because I'm probably coming out of the camera at the bottom. I'm not gonna go crazy with the ghost here because I know his eyes are gonna be showing some of the black. And there we go. Let's placing it right on top. And now just for this top piece, um, I'm going to do this one here like this and then down and then just kind of really focusing here on some of the letters. Okay, I probably came out of the camera again. <laughs> and so all I'm going to do is just take a moment and make sure that everything is lining up here okay and so once you finish getting everything glued in order to get it to hang on your wall here what you might want to do is just flip it over and get like some um foam squares and just kind of place them in a couple of spaces and then you're just going to tack it up on the wall right in the corner in the door corner all right so you could do that for both of these um and then they'll hang up and it'll be fun. It'll be just a cool decor for your house there for um, the season. So be sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel and happy crafting.